I did my job. Did the woman your wife? I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life! Okay. <laughs> O'Brien, report. All right, what is going on, everyone, and welcome back to Deacon's Heavy Breathing Simulator Apocalypse 2019 Hong Kong Goose Goose. <laughs> anyway, yes, we are back, part five. Five. I had to go get gasoline for my bikeline because I, I don't know. So <laughs> we went up to the memorial stone at the very end of the last one, and if you saw the end of it, you'll know that I fast traveled here and I had 10% on my bike. I died. I respawned, and I was like, fuck this noise. Oh, okay. Big splash. So I ran all the way up there. But a lot of stuff did happen last time that was pretty interesting. We met a new character called Lisa back in Marion Forks. I think that's where it was called. Took her, ba took her back to Tucker. That's a tongue twister. Try and say that ten times. And uh, now we have got two more missions. So we have this one over here. Uh, I think... No, that's actually a main mission. That's uh, for uh, Tucker. And I might as well just go to the storyline screen. Um, but we this is, we, is the main, main mission. So we have to go make contact with O'Brien because we heard him over the radio. We've also got to keep doing stuff for Boozer. So we got to go find some meat. We can do that on the way. And then we have this mission for Tucker. So for now, we're going to start with making contact where I believe... I don't actually know where that is. It's quite far away. But we can fast travel, so don't you even worry about it. I just got all that gas, and we're about to fast travel to a narrow research point. So we're gonna have more gas, and it's not even gonna be a problem. You remember when I said that I like I really needed to take out all of those infestation zones? This is why, because I'm a lazy bitch. I remember like back in 2017 when I did my Grand Theft Auto 5 playthrough. I think most of it I just when I was on the street I just called taxis. So clearly. I am playing the game all around. Actually, I am, but still. I need the gas. Where's the gas this at? Earth is a gift for us all. To use as we see fit. The Gaius. To provide for ourselves and our families. The Gaius. I'm not saying this. It's the Lord that gave us dominion over it. But that wasn't enough for some men. They wanted more. When our fuel got low, they jacked up the prices so they could consolidate power into their own hands. So, we wanted to build dams for electricity. But their precious runs of salmon were more important than heating our homes. We wanted to cut a few trees to build those homes. But the nests of a few spotted owls were more important than the entire timber industry. Now that the feds have gone to ground, let's just say we've eliminated the middle name. No one can stop us from taking what's rightfully ours. This is Mark Copeland. Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Thing is, Cope, fuel prices have actually come down lately. Way down. <laughs> Only problem is you gotta find it yourself. And last I checked, there's plenty of assholes out here trying to take what's rightfully ours. <sighs> no. Oh! I don't know if I was an invisible wall or I was clipping into part of the tree, but something happened and I don't know what it was. <gasps> oh my. Uh. We didn't crash though, so that's the that's the important thing. No one crashed, no one died, no one cried. And I didn't lie. Why am I rhyming so much playing this game? I don't know why. <laughs> or attempting to at least, very poorly. Alright, how much longer are we gonna be out here? We're just getting started, so pull your jets, okay? Let me get back to work. Ryan, this is gonna be it. Okay. Oh, wait, I'm not going on the bike. I have to go on the floor. Okay. Makes... Oh, they're that close. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> that does make some, some bit of sense. There he is. There's a little nerdy-ass hazmat suit. I don't know why I'm saying nerdy. I cannot speak when it comes to being that. Nerdy. Stop. Back. A of traps. I'm gonna check. Hey, Doc. How long before your job done? Shit, he's going too far away. Thought I heard 
Yeah, you thought right. <laughs> okay, Doc. Lieutenant, they'll become carrying yourself. Only animals can become carrying Corbin love humans. You guys check the perimeter, right? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Is it? Ah. I didn't see a thing. You go there. I heard something. <laughs> I will go this way. We good? Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Yeah. Lieutenant O'Brien, field note 2006. On approach to the landing site, I observed a large swarm of insects, probably Demonis Atronis or Diptera, in a clearing well away from our designated target. From that distance, I cannot discern what was attracting the insects, but from the size of the swarm, recent carry has indicated should be just over. How do you not see me? <laughs> Damn it, where's Ah, here it is. We good? Oh. I think we're almost we're almost there. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Just making sure. Here we go. Boy, we gonna sneak up and scare the pants off him. <laughs> uh, that was all right. We did all right. Poor son of a bitch. At least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. And whether that been something. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that uh, if conducting operations in quarantine zones, that if I encounter any civilians or sub <laughs> civilians, <laughs> that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like um, making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next it's night, with Nero camp, Protocol 2 7 states. <laughs> that I everyone have... was dead. Two they were slaughtered, seven... torn limb Nero for goddamn limb. Protocol All right, two listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. Crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? Yes. Okay. Okay. There you go. Don't scream. <laughs> you remember at the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember, a, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead, so I'm going to ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Like you said, the camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I... I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. <laughs> That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll check. Uh-huh, and I'm going to go with you. No, oh. wait, you can't. Please, you don't... <laughs> pay, you don't understand, but fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look, if you're going to fucking kill me, do it, okay? I did my job. Did the woman, your wife... I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life! Okay. <laughs> O'Brien, report. How do they not hear that? <laughs> Why would it- I have to go. Please, I, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you. I don't care how long it takes. I'm gonna track you down, <laughs> and I'm gonna do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. 
But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. I wonder how old he is, because he said he was a grad student in the beginning. I don't... I don't know what that means. Sorry, I'm in the UK. I don't know what that means. So was he like early 20s? 20? 21? He'd be like 23 or 4 now, wouldn't he? Okay. Well. Looks like we got another motherfucking... motherfucking uh, story mission. Oh! Shit. He said that he put her on oxygen, he gave her an IV, he kept her alive, she was septic, so she wasn't gonna make it, but Back here. he got her to the mesh unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said it. There you go! She, she can still be... She can... No, 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 no. But O'Brien is alive. And if he is, then maybe... Okay, I just gotta get this back to Boozer. It's an ambush camp. Deke! No, we're doing now. There. Booze man. Um, a few days ago, I asked you if you remembered that Nero asshole, O'Brien. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of a blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye, Booze man. I'll tell you about it later. When are we riding out of here, Deke? <laughs> Soon, loser. Real soon. Look, <clears throat> as soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. Okay. There's so many. Oh, oh my god, my game froze. Oh, oh, he sees me! Quickly! Med coming! Fuck you! Help, Brian! Oh, you son of a bitch! You better bring him. You hear me, O'Brien? You're on this channel. God, get you better get back to me, or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Damn you! Come on, Brian! Oh, that recording. What was worth the crash? Slightly. Slightly, it was. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Go away, boozer. Not now. Don't you just love it when the dialogue cuts in between each other? It's gray, isn't it? Oh, my. Go up. Hey. You've been gone a while. No one believed me. Hey, yeah. Hey, booze man. I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Hey, Deke, thanks, man. I'm not real hungry right now. I'll, I'll salt it up in a bit. You need a shower, boy. But yeah, I, I'm, I hate when the dialogue cuts in like that. That's so annoying. Because you don't know what anyone's saying. And the subtitles don't help. Because they're overlapping as well. It's just weird. It's just so weird. They won't let me leave. I'm guessing that's Tucker, isn't it? I'm just, just a thought, just a hunch. If it is, I can do yeah, that quickly. Feel. Obviously. Like, fast travel, you do a lot in this game. I'm not gonna just drive up there and then just, you know, put up more, you know, give myself more disk space. Or, you know, with no, I said that wrong. Give myself more space. I'd, I'm not... <laughs> Jesus Christ, I really didn't say that right, did I? <laughs> oh, my. Actually, there's two missions here. We got... We got this one, which is the the yellow one, and then there's like a I guess the other one's like a side mission, kind of, because we did one for Copeland, and it was just chase that down guy on the bike at the beginning of the last part. So maybe we do that again. I'm not sure. We'll just have to see. I don't know. We'll we'll try both, but it might be like a side missiony kind of video, video part. Shit! I don't know what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> oh my! How much fuel do I have? I have 14. We made it, boys. Mostly we made it. Oh my. Let me in. It's deep. Let it's cutscene time, my dudes. It is cutscene time. Might as well refuel it. Where is it? Oh, it's the mechanics here. How's it going? Did you move? Hey, what's going on? Probably not. Probably just me being a dumbass again. Fill her up. It's like all I use my camp credits for here are just to repair and refuel my 
freaking bike. Later. So do I? Oh, Can so she I does have you? a mission. Okay. Deke, uh, I, I need you to go after someone. Go after someone. Okay, what's going on? Right after you brought in that girl, Lisa. Larson brings in another one. Name was Rose Allen, a weak little thing. But we figured she could pull her own weight, help us get this irrigation ditch done. Uh, okay, so what do, you, what do you need? She's gone. She went on a supply run with Alki. Some others up to that abandoned Nero refugee camp. You know the one. I, I think you've been up there before. Yeah, 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 I know the one. Find her, Deke. There's been a bunch of drifters and squatters spotted up that way. If, if they find her first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna see what I can do. Okay, we'll do that. Just let me get this mission done. Is this even a mission? I don't even know. It's daytime now. Um, I think that's just a side mission. That's the. I don't know. Unless it's like another tutorial-based side mission. That's kind of a main mission to start off with to show you how it goes. Those goes, <laughs> and then, yeah, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I'm not entirely too sure. Might do that, and then I think we'll leave it for this one, uh, because it's going to be a short one, but uh, that's fine. I Sometimes I don't get that much time to record all the time, boys. Sometimes I only get a few minutes, so a few minutes, a few hours. I don't know. <laughs> How you doing, kid? They won't let me leave. Uh, well. <laughs> Why would you want to leave? It's safe here. I have to work. <laughs> okay. Okay. I don't know how old she is. That's it? That actually is it. Oh, for fuck's sake, game. Okay. We'll do this little side shit then. I guess I'll show you what they're like anyway. But this is the stuff that I usually do in, like, off recording. But I might as well do it for this since I've already How's opened it, it up. They u are usually very close by, and I know that you've probably been noticing this Nero site. It's in a fucking horde cave. I've tried to get it, and I haven't been able to. So that's why it's still there. So during the night, that's when you should go in. But I haven't done it yet. During the day, that's where they hibernate. So you never go in there because it's always full of, you know, uh, dead people. You got your radio on. Some time on my hands, made you some shit. Who's your thank you? Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Peek it out. Ah! Oh. I just saw it in the corner of my eye. I was looking down at the map. I goddamn saw it. I goddamn saw it. We're almost here anyway, so it's fine. We got deer as well. I already got enough meat in the bag. I haven't actually traded anything in, like any bounties or anything. I don't really care about that. I guess it's just stuff, but my hot springs. you Talk don't have to. You there. Yeah, Deke, I'm here. Hey, I'm at that location where the girl was last seen. Looks like they uh, got hit by a swarm. Oh, she shit, was she here. Did. Probably not much chance she's still alive. If she is, you'll find her. Tuck her out. <laughs> Well then, I get they're, they're fucking zombies. Who really cares? Oh, there's a lot actually. Holy shit! Quickly! Ah! Bastard! Ah! Oh. All right, bull rush this boy. Eh. It's such a it's like the most, one of the most useful upgrades in the entire game. You get this early on, I love it. Yeah, gotta take a closer yeah. look. Yeah. Oh! Just look at that. You can do that with any human enemy as well. They just work so well. That! Ah. Clip through that. What happened to you, Rose? Everyone has to work. Oh, Brad, what have we got? I mean, might be here somewhere, right? Okay, yeah, could here be. we go. She up there. Oh my god, is she up? Oh, Jesus, looks like the swarm tore him apart. <laughs> Poor bastard. Ooh. Oh. Well then. Suppose she she's up here. Oh, I can hear it. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. Someone was hanging. Their torso was just hanging in the wind. <laughs> oh my. It's all right. Don't worry, I'm taking my time. Rose? Rose <laughs> Allen, right? 
No! Hey, 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 I'm not gonna hurt you, see? I'm uh, not with those assholes. No! No! God damn it, I'm here to help. Tucker sent me. Wait, wait, I said that I am here to help you. No, you're with her. You're from the work camp. No, no, I'm with Tucker. I, uh, I, I do runs for, yeah. They starved me. I wouldn't follow her orders, so they wouldn't feed me. Woman, well, I mean, it's a work camp. I mean, everyone's got to work. <laughs> I'm not a slave. I'm not going back, do you hear me? I'd rather die out here. Okay, 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 God damn it. Go on. Well then. That was it. That's basically what side missions I do and when I'm not, you know, filming them. That's why I don't show them. <sighs> Pretty much so. I think that for now, that's actually everything that we've got done so far. Yeah, so we just gotta wait until we get a radio from someone else. And I'm pretty sure... I don't know... No, there's no bunker here, is there? It's not an ambush. No, it's not an ambush camp. I don't know what I'm saying. Probably was. No, it's probably nothing anymore. You know what? There was an upgrade for Deacon to learn how to slide down these mother trucking freaking ass ladders. I, I would would be the first thing I would upgrade because this boy's slow AF. Slow AF. Are you gave me spell over my monitor. Slow AF. I don't know why I did that. I'm sorry. <laughs> there is stuff in here we can look at though. Oh, there was a nest in here. Did I burn this? I don't think I burned this. What durability is my thing at? Ah, I can repair that. I can repair that. That's fine. There's nothing else here. Is nope. There's this. Besides that, I think we're done. Yeah, look at that. We're fine. <laughs> okay then. Well, we cleared everything we need to do now. There isn't even. There's. They still haven't. Oh. Hey boy. Eh, there you go. Oh. Okay. Sorry, I need it. the meat, kind of. Oh? Oh? Oh. There you go. <laughs> I had to just wait. <gasps> oh, boy. Tis very funny. Tis very, very funny. Oh, my. Alright, let's go. Let's ride! I don't know where we're riding to, but we're riding somewhere. Oh! There's no one in here. I'm finally getting this thing. Beacon. I still haven't got... Okay. Where is it? <laughs> I still haven't got, like, a, um... A mission yeah, pop-up yet. It's been, like, injector. 15 minutes. See if it still works. I've just been driving around and nothing's been happening. Uh, we'll go with hell for this one. Why not? But, like, nothing's happened! Uh... day. <sighs> not recording as well. Michael, recording. Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! Legit, like, I still haven't got a mission. You know what? I'm actually gonna let these boys kill me. You may eat me so that something may happen. Please, just be gentle. Eh. Oh! I'm dead. Now, maybe. I don't know if the game's glitched or not. Yeah. Okay. Well, since I'm not actually getting. Any missions pop up right now because I think the game's kind of glitching away. I'm not sure what's happening, but for some reason, it ain't giving me any missions. So I feel like instead of driving around longer and giving myself more, you know, hassle by doing that, we're just going to end this part here. And it was a bit shorter, but you know what? Like I said, nothing's popping up right now, and I don't actually have that much time to keep filming for this, this day. So I am going to leave at this part of Days Gone Here. I hope you all enjoyed, and with all of that being said, I will see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone.